Welcome back to another episode of MotoGP Mac, and today we're going to talk about Gigi Delinia's comments back to Paolo Campinati's comments about Ducati abandoning its young rider program. Now, speaking recently, Gigi said, First of all, I want to thank Pramac and Paolo for all these years spent together and for the beautiful things we've done together. Ducati has grown thanks to their contribution, thanks to the fact that together we have developed our bike and the talents to ride it. They have certainly done an important job and we are sorry both from a professional and a human point of view to lose such a beautiful and important reality. Having said that, unfortunately the whole world wanted us to lose a team next year and it has happened. We haven't changed our philosophy. We want to continue to focus on the young rider. We have signed a contract with Fermain Aldeguer whom is a young rider and we have a lot of hope in. We would like to do with Fermain exactly what we did with Peko and Elie and also with Martin. It is clear we will no longer do it with Pramac, but we will do it with another team. We will now have three teams and no longer four. Life goes on, so we will move forward. Now for me, I think it's quite funny. I think there's definitely a sour taste in Gigi's mouth about the whole Pramac exit. And I think both men are pretty annoyed at each other, if I'm honest. I think when I look at it, you know, 20 years together and it kind of splits up and one is pointing the finger at the other saying, oh, well, you ban- abandoned your young rider thing. Now, when you look at Ducati, okay, if they were staying firm to that young rider thing, they would have promoted Martin, but the decision with Marc Marquez is made now it's done you know they have signed from Ain Aldeguer and I, I do genuinely believe the position that Ducati is in you know having one young rider it's more than enough you know you don't need two rookies in because you know if you had Martin and you had Peko in the main factory team that factory team is pretty young so you know you can don't need two 19 or 20 year olds, you know, just coming into MotoGP. So, you know, I think Ducati are in a different phase now, whereas you look at KTM, technically they could have afforded to have two rookies at the start, you know, coming in, learning, blooding them in, getting them used to it. Whereas Ducati have the bike, you know, they have the pick of the litter, you know, they have, they can choose. So, okay, we're going to take this unpolished diamond and make him, the next Peko or Martin. So I do find it interesting. I don't think it's their abandoning their young rider thing, but I think the philosophy has kind of changed. They will keep a young rider, but you know, the other three factory bikes will go to experienced people in my view. But I would definitely love to know your thoughts. What do you think of Gigi versus Paolo on their spat? at the weekend definitely leave your thoughts in the comments below and i'll be back again tomorrow with another video